So I have a question for you. What do you do when you have frustration or discomfort in your life? Is it like the fight or flight options, you know? Are you in and you're, you know, ready to go? Or is it you're out of there and you kind of disappear for a little bit? Well, stick with me for a minute because discomfort and frustration I've found to be very thankful for. Welcome to this episode of Be a Business Development Rockstar with business development specialist, Nikki Llewellyn. Okay, so it's been many years of me learning the same lesson over and over is every time I go through a big challenge or I'm frustrated with a person that I'm working with or I'm frustrated that I said yes to something and now I'm working on a project that really isn't fitting and and fitting into my goals or, or I should have said no to this. You know, all of these different things that we do that frustrate us, there's a reason for that frustration and there's a reason for, you know, the discomfort that we go through when sometimes we aren't, you know, revenue numbers aren't where they need to be. It's because we're not doing something right or we've made choices that aren't the best ones for us. And so what I choose to do is look at discomfort and frustration as the launching pad for something new. It's we're making change. And so what I want you to get in the habit of is every time that you're frustrated, I bet one of you watching this video today is frustrated right now. So when you're frustrated, whether it's right now or this happens next week, I want you to, first of all, be thankful for the frustration. So hard to do because it's like, why am I going to be thankful for the frustration? I want things to be easier. Be thankful for the frustration because that is what your, that is your launching pad to change so that this stuff does not happen anymore. So first of all, you know, say you're thankful for that. Number two, identify what is the challenge? What's the problem? What's this, what's the learning in this? So let's say that you've got this three hour commitment on your calendar, but you know, you have all of these other things to do to reach goals, maybe business goals or things you need to do for your family. Why did you say yes to that three hour planning meeting or whatever that three hour meeting was without really looking through and looking at your time for the things that you must get done? What that's going to teach you over time is, okay, maybe I need to really take a look at the month at a bigger picture before I start saying yes to things. And all of a sudden you get really good at being selective and saying no. And so what I'm saying is the first step is to be thankful when you're going through the the frustration, just have gratitude for that. Number two, you're looking for the lesson. What is it that you're going to learn from this so it doesn't happen again? Number three, be thankful again that you just learned that lesson. You just, you've embraced it and you're like, okay, I'm so glad that this happened because this is not going to happen to me any, anymore. And number four, change, make the change. So, you know, if you have certain cycles in your life that you're frustrated with, look at it and look, how can I, you know, what is it that I need to learn from this and make the change and make a new habit to eliminate that frustration. So no more of that, um, you know, looking in the rear view mirror when you're, you know, looking backwards because you're looking for the lesson behind you, look for the lesson in what you're experiencing right now. And I guarantee you that frustration and discomfort will become more of a opportunity and you'll see more um, positive in that. So enjoy, hopefully that's helpful. Thank you for watching this episode of Be A Business Development Rockstar with Nikki Llewellyn. For more great information, visit the Rainmakers website at gorainmakers.com. Also browse the other shows found right here on this Biz TV Shows Network.